Well, the Brampton Library played host to a number of poetry readings that aim to educate as well as entertain. First Local, Joanne Davis reports. A healing pain resort in North India has always been a source of inspiration to me. Strangely enough, the beauty of Canada reminds me of my birth place a lot. It was a poetry reading meant to connect cultures. Many Brampton residents gathered Sunday to kick off the beginning of South Asian Heritage Month, with the only walls up being those of Brampton's South Fletcher's Library. It's so special to learn the traditions and the heritage and all of the special attributes, the art, the culture, the poetry of the people who are now uh, living here in the city of Brampton. Nina, if you wouldn't mind to come to receive this, we would appreciate that. Mina Chopra, a Mississauga resident, was honored at the event for her work connecting Canada with other cultures, including her recent work published in three different languages. The immenseness of the sky, the glory of the setting sun, with the ever-changing colors and the uh, unlimited wide expanse of the earth stills my nature within. Our celebrations are embraced. Brampton is a family uh, oriented city and people that move to Brampton uh, take pride in coming out and being part of learning, giving and sharing. With more than 170 different cultures living throughout Brampton, you can be sure that more celebrations will continue throughout the month. In Brampton, Joanne Davis, First Local.